What the cock, my eyes, Pelic here, and welcome back to everyone's favorite game that never gets patched, Man of Madame. Actually, it got an addition. Sorry if that intro was that. Look, I'm still worried about my headphones. They always fly away. And yes, I have a sore thing on my chin. And no, you can't lick it. Get your own plague. Actually, you don't. Take care of yourselves. I hope you are taking care of yourselves. Last time, we escaped all sorts of crap, and then we got to like a wee... A wee safe spot. Well, safe is very... What's that word? Subjective. I think that's the word. Look, if it's not, I'm sorry. I went out of my way to use a big word, but everyone's still alive. I hope you are too. Let's continue. Sorry, I know it was a terrible intro, but deal with it, okay? You remember this? Our nice wee cozy house. What the hell was wrong with you back there? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. Right? What, what are you talking? Come on. No. Yes. Oh, come on, that's ridiculous. It's what the fuck is going on with this ship? Good question. Because, I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Yeah. Let's just stay <laughs> calm and relatively sane about this, okay? That means you, Brad. This stuff you I feel saw, so far, but... it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and... That doesn't sound zombies. that crazy right about now. I saw something. This, it's, uh, uh it's this old lady. <laughs> I mean, she was batshit crazy and, like, dinosaur old. Not that that's a bad thing, but she just, like, up and vanished on me. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were, there were things walking around with his face on them. <sighs> Alex's face, it... It was horrifying. Must be especially bad for Julia. Yeah. Someone's having nightmares. I've never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know. It's just... What does that have to... Time out, okay? Jeez. This place is too fucked up to just be fucked up. Yes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Whatever comrade's saying. I mean, like, agree. something is going on here. Yeah. So what do we know for sure thing, right? that we can all agree? And there's the Manchuring Gold. We know that uh, this is a ghost ship. I don't <laughs> Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? Like, oh, ghost ships are real, and this ghosts. is one, and we're totally on it, and no, holy <laughs> shit, we're so totally fucked. Julia! She's gonna say that. the same thing. Me I know we're thing. not the first people to see weird shit here. Apparently, the guards were super freaked out oh, by yeah. something they saw in the cargo holes. That's what Reading does. We found me. a note that said a bunch of guys tried to get out of guard duty because they were really freaked out by something. <sighs> what? Uh, what happened to the ship? What do you think actually think happened to, to this know. place? A goddamn mystery box is what it is. Looks yes. like the newspaper was from that 1947. That's my question, so. Oh, so it's after the war. <gasps> Where's the gold? Did you see the gold? Anything? I saw Manchurian, Manchurian gold. gold isn't actually gold. Is it the it's gas? It's a fucking chemical and it's leaking all over cargo hold too. That was my theory. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this isn't exactly what our friendly fishermen are expecting either. Uh, well, you gotta protect go the pirates. Well. I don't know what you just said. Why the... The crew is obviously dead. Yes, this place is definitely weird. But let's ask What her. happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? They're dead. It all feels more like a mausoleum. We're on the grinds. Than a ship. So where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We know more than we did before. That's interesting. Yeah, That's something at least. We're wasting time. Mm. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. <clears throat> time to get we're off the ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. You'd think. If we it can find a... it and use it. Oh. That's great, but do you think it still works? Hell no. Just need to find a way up there. Where would you be if you were radio on a giant warship? I'd be up high somewhere so I could like radio it across the sea and everybody be like, Oh my goodness, it's radio person from his fancy tarp. Man, the hell is with this performance? Can you not be so broken? We gotta get off this damn ship. Brad. No shit. You could cut this metal with your uh, brain power. Speaking clinically, totally effed. Brad, shut up. Let's go. Man, why does this control and look like perform so bad? What's this? It seems to be getting a little bit better, but not really. What are you? That's that's like a, a bullet shell thingy, right? They. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. Right? That's what I was gonna say. I would have said it more interestingly, but Brad beat me to it because Brad sucks and he steals things. Sorry, <laughs> that wasn't nice. It wasn't a racial thing either, so don't even go there. Look at the nice big chimneys they have and these weird mask things which they had because I don't know. They were like, you know what? I know I ship parts by steam, but let's have some seals for giggles. 
Why are you guys- Do you want to get murdered on your own? <sighs> I forgot, sorry I meant if the controller plugged in for this, so if people die because of keyboard. Don't <laughs> it. Julia! Come here, wifey. You gotta- <gasps> Invest- Julia was like, I'll drag behind and show him the room, but good job, Julia. Let's investigate him. If we can. Could we use this? No. Great. Hmm. Could you use these if they weren't Swiss cheese? Right? I was actually gonna say that too. Damn you, Alex! <laughs> I wonder which one of us is dumber, me or Alex. Uh, we're gonna have a showdown. Bash our brains together. There wouldn't be much damage done, but when it was over, we could like answer basic questions and then we could see who failed the police. <laughs> I don't know. Guys, is that Fliss and Conrad or Fliss and Brad? It can't be Fliss and Brad. They shouldn't be spending much time together. He's a danger to Final way up. Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Okay, I was kind of hoping you'd do that, but thanks for clarifying. Where'd Comrade go? <gasps> What's he see? Like, he's basically our leader, bizarrely. <laughs> Comrade, can I please talk to you? <sighs> Brad, this is your time to shine. You're like, hey, it's me, Brad. You forgot about me, but I have loads of good ideas and stuff. Beyond hitting friends with spanners. What the hell's this? <gasps> please don't be in scary. Oh, I gotta hold it. Whoosh! What the fuck? Oh, it's his diary. Dear diary. Today I hid in a cupboard, and the stupid game won't let me read crap. Read it! So I gotta hold this, I guess. Okay. What does it say? Always ensure your- uh, Must have been moving some pretty dangerous cargo. Uh. Make sure your mask is properly glued to your face before attempting to get higher. <laughs> I don't know. Like, my theory is that you guys thought to ask me to tell you this. I think the Manchurian gold was, it was actually a chemical weapon. We saw it in mustard gas. I think it was maybe a leftover weapon that had been used in some wartime atrocity. Maybe on like a tribe or something. And then the tribe's all pissed and they've come to curse us with their crazy ass voodoo. That's just my theory. Watch yours. Like, it would explain quite a few things. Not Brad's Cardis or Alex's lack of brain cells, but some things, you know. What if we just boing up there? Hey! A little help over here. Brad, you're up. <laughs> You've been useless. So you go up there, huh? Well, Conrad will play phones. I think this is our way up. <laughs> Jeez. Give Man. me a look. Fles oh my goodness, she's such a strong independent. Oh no, it's Alex. Well, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Alex, up you go. He's the athletic one, right? I should have seen that. I'll pull you up. <laughs> Why are they going up first? Should they not have thought about who should go up in order? Why am I thinking? Nobody else is. What do you see, Fliss? She seems a little bit worried. Like, beyond the obvious. Huh. <laughs> there goes that scene. Brad, you are such an idiot. I am most disappointed in you as my little bro- Like, I expected him to be the brains of things, but... Oh no! He is the closest to actually murdering one of his own friends. So, yeah, it's the opposite of being the brains. Do these guys want to stick together? I guess not. This is... This is, this is where I chased Conrad before. Oh. Huh. She I thought was it looked familiar. The scary. <gasps> Why were you being that scary woman then? Remember, right? The scary woman thing chased Conrad across the bridge, but it wasn't Fliss. So, like, sorry. I have a lot of questions. Like, if that was Fliss, why couldn't we hear her being like, Hey, Conrad, it's not a terrible scary woman Smeagol thing. It's me. Julia, what are you doing? Why are you just... <sighs> Why'd I even ask? Can I go in here? Now. Over here! Yes. <laughs> okay. Got a way through here. Hi. Oh, we gotta aid this. Um... I think I'm... <laughs> Come on, sir. Good man. So it's weird without the controller because I can't remember which button's which. <sighs> Maybe we can just hide that and seal away and then we can flush out the rest or something later. This isn't the. Oh, this is the bridge, right? Yeah, Conrad ran along here and into the bridge. I don't think the radio's on the bridge, though. I'm sure there's some great stuff. <gasps> what have we here? What is it? It's the log. <gasps> This'll tell us what happened. Maybe. How'd I read it? Oh, there. Okay. What we got? Huh. 
Last log shows him caught in a storm. Hmm. Maybe that's relevant. When that storm for skating strength, weather is exceptional, but several lighting. Whoa, hitting the OM. What's that? By causing no sustained damage, we are leaking some water, but it's under control. Why are you carrying water? <laughs> oh, water's leaking in. Sorry. Navigator ports see. I don't know what that means. Let's turn this page. Why are we reading it backwards? Is it manga? Our bearings got updated. See, going down. Huh? What the, is in the water or are we going down? Thick fog, increasing head. I don't know what this sailor crap even means. Fog is very thick. <laughs> Not great. Is that everything then? Looks like it. You know what? Screw your logbook. I think I've got all my secrets. It looks like... Or not. That's just... It's weird to control. Like, they still haven't patched this for Windows 7. And the PC controls don't friggin' work. <laughs> there you go. But they keep releasing new content. Because, you know, why fix your game when you can always just, like, sell things to people or whatever, you know? It is the way, in a sort of not cool Mandalorian way. Can I go in here? No. Crap! Where? Why is all the doors on this stupid ship locked? <sighs> like you'd think if they're being eaten by ghosts, they could at least be like, you know what we should do? We should unlock all of our doors so people can escape. Well, actually, I guess they'd want to lock it in. What do I know? I haven't been chased by ghosts recently, in all honesty. Man, fucking door. Where did I go? Maybe this way. <clears throat> There's something. <gasps> it's Final radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. Yeah, but find it. Jeez, why just stop? Not exactly confident about our chances of survival at this point. Brad, nobody asked you. You make everything worse. What's this crap? Is that their course? Oh, something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's a bit Sounds squiggly. Like they didn't want it? anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean. Hmm. It looks kind of like battleships to me, but then I am mentally damaged. It's a secret. Well, I guess it tells us that what they were like actually intending or what they weren't intending to get to San Francisco with the appearance of sobriety <laughs> or whatever the hell. What's this say? <gasps> Read it. I'm sorry there's so much reading crap, but... <gasps> uh, ship was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Hmm. Blah 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 boring. Gotcha. So maybe there wasn't actually their deliberate course. The sea was just blowing them all over the place and like, oh crap, the sea's carrying us all squiggly lines. And in the future some millennials gonna be like, ha, look at your sailing course, that's silly. But it wasn't their fault, you know. This is I remember this from the future. Past. <laughs> that's the one. And he was like, um, doing this radio man person things and then the monster killed him, basically. What's this thing? Yeah, that's gross. What the dead person did like This poor sucker bit it right in the middle of his message. <gasps> yeah, made it. I remember that. Radio contact into bed, 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 many crew dead. Yeah, mm, I noticed. Sounds pretty desperate. Oh. Maybe it wasn't him that wrote that. You gotta think outside the box. That's a radio. Or maybe it's a jukebox. Take a look. I hope it's a radio. No freaking way. What? This thing actually still works? Well, That's radio it. science hasn't changed much in 70 years. True. As long as there's power. The joys of backwards world. technology. Let's twiddle some things. <laughs> I have no idea. Ah, it's working! Right? I hear born weather forecasts. I kinda wish I didn't, but they're bad enough in it's a normal life. Where's the... Military bandit. Let's have some for help. Oh, I wouldn't. They'll probably bomb us, because they'll be like, you know you're on the hey, SS military hey, secrets. is anyone uh, out there hearing this? Hello? I don't trust oh, them. Oh shit, we got him. Uh, Does this seem too good to be true to anyone? Uh, uh, let's do that first. Look how bad If you can hear us, we're on a we ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately... <laughs> 12 degrees 30 minutes south, 151 degrees 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We How does he know that? Please repeat. Please repeat. Just write it down, jeez. Tell him again, Alex. Uh, we're on the 
Orang Matan. Well, it's like old freighter. We think the name of it is the Orang Matan. That's the one. It Hello. sounds like a rang attack, Hello. sorry. Is anyone out there? Please, come in! I knew it seemed too good to be true. Why did the lights go off too? Yo, guys! Check it out! No. I don't want to go down there, it looks scary. Even the orchestra thinks it's scary. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find. Well, it's not a friggin' wormhole. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I gotta be honest. I don't smart. think I'm gonna make it down there in my shape. I'll go. Obviously. I can do this. <laughs> no, I should be the can't. one to go. Badger, hope that's good. Bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what are you What are you talking about? Uh, Stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. He tried to get fast with a spanner! Works, not if the pitch is a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. Well, I'm not. Oh my goodness. Please stop. So what do you think? <sighs> I think Alex is off his head too. I'm, <laughs> hey, I'm sure you're up. You sure you're up for it? I believe you got it, bro. If and I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julian, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this. Trust me. We start in the love triangle Hello. early. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. But case closed. Okay, Julia. It's you and I. What was with them? <laughs> I'm not sure if that was like sudden feminism or what. But why didn't Alex? <laughs> Is this how we handle things? What? Who was it who said this was a bad idea? That would be me. Idiot. <laughs> Brad, if you landed on Julie, I'll kill you. Oh no, she's there. Oh. Flesh, you're looking mighty Broken stupid right bones. now. Everything still work? Mm. Everyone okay? Great. We just fell down a massive hole. We're okay. Let's be helpful because we gotta convert Brad into okay. a good person. What are we person. gonna do? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Alright. I was gonna ask why. We'll wait here by the radio. Oh, here's a shiny here. metal thing. <laughs> Enjoy. Oh, it's a lighter. If Brad does stupid things, set him on fire. Right? I said my dad does what's for, but that's what I'd use it for. Oh, look. Hey. A tiny little metal wall in this thing. Someone stick your head in it or something. After you. Brad's the card here. Julie's honestly the braver one. Okay. I don't want to do any more. I'm going to get someone killed if I do anymore because I don't have the right... Look, we got... No, you don't need to tell me how to walk forwards. I know. I think we should leave it here because I got the wrong controller plugged in and it's kind of fiddly to plug in. The Look, shut up with your W's, okay? And I don't want anyone to get killed because I can't control it. I know this episode was kind of weird, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Brad, what you doing? You <laughs> weird guy. If you did, please consider leaving a like, okay? Because it really helps. Thank you just for being here with me, okay? I really appreciate it. I'll see you tomorrow, right? I don't even know what this is. I guess it's just like a a chance to see the characters. <laughs> it's kind of putting me up. It's a Carousel's game. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!